Hi, today I'm going to show you how to create Bitcoin invoices using Blockonomics. The first way, utilizing your Bitcoin address to create easy single use uh, invoices, and the second way, using Bitcoin's Wallet Watcher feature and your XPUB key, which allows you to uh, create invoices for your wallet uh, easily without having to go look up that Bitcoin address over and over again. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so now we're going to look at how to set up a single-use invoice, uh, which you don't even need to create an account for, uh, which is nice. You just need one on the go. So you'll notice that I'm on the Blockonomics main page, as you can see, and you'll see the white bar in the center, the Bitcoin addresses and transaction ID. This is where you're going to be putting your Bitcoin address in order to set up an invoice. So you'll notice uh, you can do that two ways, one through a QR code, you just click that, the camera would turn on, and you put the QR code in there like that. Or you can use this bar to copy and paste the code. So what you do is you go to your wallet. So I've set up this blockchain wallet, uh, but it's the same on any of the wallets. Um, you'd go to your receive, your request, uh, depending on the wallet, what uh, term they use, but it's for receiving receiving Bitcoin. So you'll click on that and you'll notice there's a Bitcoin address here. You want to copy and paste that. Oh well, copy it at this point. You can also view the QR code there. That's what you'd use to scan the QR code. Um, and then you go back to Blockcoin and you'd paste it into the bar. And you'll notice that it comes up with the balance and so on of your account. But what we're concerned about is the create peer-to-peer -peer invoice, P2P. So you'd click that and you're taken to this area. You can update the description. You can set an amount. You can choose a file uh, to upload. Um, this is the QR code and the address. You can adjust it if you need to, but since you input it earlier, it should be all set. You can also set an expiration date in order to uh, uh, have a limited amount of time that it's done. And this is literally all you need to do. You create, you just once you click create invoice, you set up peer-to-peer -peer encrypted invoice, which is pretty easy. So you'll notice here, you've got your URL. You can copy that and send it to people and you can send it in an email or whatever, and all you need to do is put it into the URL box. You go, boom, there's your invoice. Then this is what the person would see who's sending you the Bitcoin. So you notice, here's the description, the amount that they need to send you, the location that they send it, some instructions, etc. Okay, so now we're going to look at how to create an invoice using your XPUB key in the, that's uh, your extended public key in the Wallet Watcher tab. For this, you are going to need to create an account uh, to use it. Now you'll notice I'm black on the Blackonomics homepage. I'm going to click on the Wallet Watcher tab. You'll be then brought to your dashboard for your account. Uh, and in order to set up um, the uh, invoices you're going to need to insert your XPUB key. So you're going to need to go to Address Watcher, and this is where you're watching the uh, addresses for your wallets. You're going to want to click on New Address, and you'll see again you can enter in your address here by copy and pasting or typing, or you can use the QR code. Uh, if you need any more help after this video, you can click on the question mark here, and it gives you how to do it on the variety of wallets. So, uh, I'm going to show you how to do this with blockchain then, how to find your XPUB key on blockchain and insert it into the uh, tab. So you're going to go to blockchain, and you're on your home page. You're going to go to settings, addresses, manage, more options, and then show XPUB. You'll be given a warning 
that you shouldn't ex share your extended public key with anybody, or at least those who you do not don't share with those who you don't trust. And you click continue, and then you're brought to your XPub key. So you've got your QR code that you can use to scan, or your code here. You want to copy and copy that, and then go back to block blockonomics and paste it into there. Then click add. You'll notice there it is, your XPub key right there. Now you can set up invoices. So you're gonna go to receive and you'll see you've got your XPub chain and your receiving address. So you'll want to create an invoice. And again, we're back on this invoice page where you can set up a description, set in the amount, get your address right here, your expiration date, etc. And you will then create the invoice, get your URL, again like the beginning, that you can send to people, and voila. There is your invoice, and you can send this and get paid in Bitcoin.